Hi guys, welcome to another episode here of Use Cross Stars here with Cambridge United. We're into the final season. Yes, this is it. Final season. It's going to be a bit of a, a weird season in the fact that it's just going to be literally rushed through. All we're going to be con concentrating on, or should I say I'm concentrating on, is in Champions League. That's it. That is all we've got to try and do. If we can win that one, then great. If we can't, we can't. And that's it. And that's the end of it. And that'll be it for FIFA 19. Done, dusted, not doing anything else on this game ready for PES 2020 and obviously FIFA 20 as well. So, not going to be putting up as many episodes um, as normal. Um, so, probably over the next couple of weeks, it'll probably just only have like, a couple episodes a week. So, if you click that bell notification, then you'll know when they go up. Um, but yeah, it's, I'm just going to take it a little bit easier. Not going to have like five episodes going up a week. No need to, to do that. Um, Take things a little bit easier going into when PES comes out and, and FIFA 20 comes out. So um, that's basically it. I'll give you more of a, a lowdown of how things are going to go in those, like, you know, those sort of games. Um, I'll probably put an episode up. Might be at the weekend, might be in the week. I don't know. Like I say, if you click the bell, then you'll know when a video goes up or if you're like, you know, um, log on to and and follow me on Twitter then you'll see when when the video goes up as well so do one of those and, and you won't miss out and um, just want to let, let you know that I have gone ahead and bought Alistair Wild don't worry if you're wondering why his head's like gone gray I've changed his hair color basically um, because he looks very much like Yanni Schutz and I just thought rather than mess around changing his face or anything it was just easier to change his hair color uh, i will show you that um, in a moment and um, lee phillips has gone out to sassuolo um, on loan as well so that is what has happened in at the beginning um, because obviously we are going to be whipping through this and stuff like that I'm not going to be too fussed about community shield just simming through literally just trying to get in today's episode want to try and get up to the group stage um and to you know to to find out who we're going to get in the champions league and stuff like that not even going to be registering like the goals and stuff that you score guys you know what i mean because i'm not taking the season like that serious like i say it's all about uh, champions league but as you'll see i've changed jb3's number so now he has jb and the number three on his back um so um sorry bear hams but um i've took your number three off you <laughs> um just to, just so he's, he says like he's got a jb and then it's three underneath so it like it works out timo Werner and Zelinski getting the goals there for um Liverpool, I have switched a few numbers round actually, to be honest. Yanni Schutz is not number nine. Giving that to you now, Charlie. You're number nine. Uh, you're the number nine at the club. Um, so that's what I've done there. Okay, so um, here is the, the lineup, as you can see. Um, our front line is, is frightening. Um, we've got Charlie up to a 95 now, and Hyder and Garber either side of him at 96. Um, we've got two 92s in the midfield with Warren and Mahoney. Um, and then we've got Arnas, who's just close to a 90 at 89. We've got Bearham's 91, Musley's a 96, Akinola's a 93, all adds up to an 88, and Rodolfo's a 94. They've got a 94 rated goalkeeper as well in Donna Rumor, but they've also got one of our ex players, Harry Edwards, in the centre with Winks and Goretzka. Um, so. so, in real life, we are actually Chelsea going into this one and AC Milan and Liverpool. That makes sense because they won. Um, the Champions League and we won the Europa League so we're going in I suppose you could say as underdogs with them being the Champions League winners so um, but on paper yeah definitely not that but as the saying goes not played on paper is it but as you see the stadium split there half and half of orange and then black and red it's not like that in real life is it uh, most of the fans don't get hardly any tickets which is absolutely crazy isn't it like, but anyway there's your way for in FIFA for you right let's get things off and running here then um, and see if we can pick up um, a trophy that we've not won um, in the colours um, of amber Akinola forward here to Arnas. It is Captain Mosley, who is now the club captain because um, and Pepper is only 90 rated now. Oh, and Arnas, uh, not Arnas, um, Berham's offside. Yeah, um, Marco Mosley is now actually the club captain um, fully. Um, just because, like I say, and Pepper now is, is only 90 rated, so it's going to be difficult for him to get as much game time. Well, I'll see again. Dispossessed by Musley. Arnas now. Here's Garber. I'm not sure what he was trying to do there. It was a pass supposedly out to the wing, but well, what happened there? 
Plays it across and Warren hits the post. Wow, it's nicely done by Bearhams to see Warren coming in with the big man. Oh, and looks like Harry Edwards, our former player, is actually, that's it, 23 minutes or so in and his, his game's over. Wow, I don't even know what happened there. But he's holding his knee and, yeah, the new signing. As you can see, it's Jake Warren just coming down and maybe... I think he's holding his shoulder as well. I don't know. He's just landed on him, hasn't he? And you don't want Jake Warren landing anywhere near you. Like, you know, it's like an earthquake. Arnus nicely stepped inside. Goes for it. Oh, I was just about to say it was one of his specials. Didn't half catch hold of that. Donnarumma is beaten here, I think, if that's on target. Well, maybe not. He might have got a hand to it. Jake Warren, can he get it back to Charlie? He can. It's a great opportunity here. Charlie, bang, thank you very much, we'll have that. New number nine, well, he has been at the club, he's just not, he's got the number nine now for this season, this final season. You can see only the one attempt, we're definitely bossing it when it comes to attempts, we just need to get more of them on target. It's just a poor effort. Whipped in from Suso, and that's a great strike. What a strike is that? Is that Draxler? It was. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Just a hell of a strike. Thought I had it covered. Um, Rodolfo got a hand to it, but not keeping that out. He got everything on it. Mahoney just, just slipping there. And I think that's what gave him the space. And Rodolfo nearly, nearly keeping it out. Mendy's come across, Garber's done well, used a bit of strength, Mahoney inside, now sees Charlie Lawrence but being forced back, he's done well, ah, Goretzka there, wow, followed that pattern completely, now, here goes Draxler, played in, what a hit again, and Castillo, wow, okay, okay, they've suddenly just suddenly started playing, that all sort of stems from Goretzka um, following the play between Mahoney and, and Charlie. Look at that. So he's hit that superbly on the volley and don't care who, which goalie you are, you ain't saving this because it's just the sheer power. It's just, it's already, it's already in as soon as he's left his foot. Play through. Warren, can you get this through to Charlie? You can. Donnarumma's there. Jump. Oh, for God's sake, why don't they never jump? All right, things are just not going in our favor right now. Definitely not going in our favor. What has happened here? Everything is just falling from Milan on a plate right now. Wow. I don't know where Milan have suddenly appeared from, but they've certainly definitely appeared. Let's put it that way. Um, oh, okay. Come on, Garber. Oh, yeah, okay. Really? I hit this as a low... Dri oh, it's hit his leg, all right. I'm going to say I hit that as a low-driven shot and it flew up in the air. He's actually got his foot to it. Wow. Oh. Pulisic is there. Warren. Oh, yes. Well done, Charlie. Deft little header. Pick the ball up, please. Thank you. Let's go. What a ball in here from Jake Warren. And Charlie with a lovely little deft header. And things like that is what's going to catch Donna Rumor out. If I'd have hit that like full blown, he'd have saved this. But it was just a little. See, it actually even hit his arm late. But. All right. Okay. Here we go, our lad. Charlie! Yes! That trick! Oh! Wow, he's loving this number nine shirt. Let's put it that way. What a ball in from our lad. What a ball in. And what a finish. Wow. Okay. Well, this has turned out to be an entertaining game, hasn't it? Wow. Charlie knocks it back. Tomo now. Can he get Garber? No, he's actually gone to Arlad. It's Arlad. Cuts inside. Plays it across. It's Charlie again. This time Langley's actually there. Hiding out. 
Plays this back to Bearhams. Whips the chance in. Charlie's in there again, but no. Langley's there. Musley now. Ah. Oh, they're just getting... Oh, no ref. What are you blowing for? I had a, there is going to go to extra time. I had a literally had a chance then to like have a late shot, and he blew the whistle. I mean, if you look at that, how how well we know how, don't we? Do you know what I mean? But yeah, we know exactly how why the score is what it is. Okay, a couple of changes then. Charlie is um, as you can see, he's got a hat trick. He's he's tired though, so JB three has come on in place of him, um, and Clark has come on in place of um, Jake Warren. Mahoney forward, here is JB3. Oh, Clark, yeah. Is he on side? Yes. Well, there you go. Two substitutes have just combined. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable stuff. They've literally just come on. It got played through to JB, plays it through. Here to Clark. Clark hits the post and then turns and then hits it in with two AC Milan defenders stood in the goal. They're not going to save much from there, are they? Two of them are like stood behind the line. I mean, you're AC Milan manager. You're you're literally cursing right now. Why are two defenders off the field? Wow, what an introduction from Malcolm and JB then. <laughs> Still Garber. Playback. Mahoney. Oh, bar. Hide it. St ah, Castillo. Him and Draxler have been a pain in the arse. Musley, great header. Tomo now. Here's Garber. Played inside. Mahoney. Oh, pick that out. There we go. There we go. Nice one. Here's Garber. Oh, and now he's gone again. Here is Jay Thomas, fresh on. Trying to hold this up. Lays it back here to Tomo. He's going to go for this. Oh! What a goal that would have been. Oh, my word. That wasn't far away. Outside of the foot, this as well. That was not too far away. Wow. What a goal that would have been. Garbert. Thomas, go all the way back here. And Akinola has got, as you can see, um, he has got like the little first aidy thing. Musley will go long here. And he might have got... Oh, I was going to say he might have got higher in, but Donnarumma, well, okay. Off his line quick. There it is. We've won the Super Cup. It was nervy um, when Milan suddenly went 3-1 up um, from absolutely nowhere. Um, no idea what all that was about. But this man here, wow, with two great headers, two great balls in to find his head. And um, yeah, we've ended up um, getting ourselves another piece of um, silverware. Um, like I say, I think Milan stamina just went. I think they just went all out. They must have changed the... It, obviously, the attack, they went all out because it just felt like they were like everywhere we were. Here we go, though. I won't do, like, you know, a big celebration -y thing here. It's not that big a trophy, but it is a big trophy. Don't get me wrong. It's still a big one. It's it's the winners of the, both of the European competitions, like, in, in the day. Super Cup winners, and we are there. 22 shots, 30. I know it went to extra time, but, wow, it's still a massive amount. Like, you know what I mean? Um, Charlie getting man of the match for having a hat-trick, um, but, yeah. Great, great, um, great trophy. When, when is the draw? Like, is it in September? Do we, no, I don't mean the draw's going to... I'm going to fast forward it to here. Let's fast forward it to there. Have we got any draw situations? Looks like we have. Looks like we've got something going on here. Here we go. Draw time, folks. Monaco, Hoffenheim, Lokomotiv, Moscow. Wow, that's a brilliant group to have. I mean, let's get more into that. That's... That's a fantastic group to have. Monaco, Hoffenheim and Lokomotiv. I mean, Hoffenheim, I think... Did Hoffenheim get... They were in the Europa League with us last... And they got to the quarters of the semi, so... I don't know, but... Couldn't have asked for an easy group there, could we? No, you cannot mean, but let's see the other groups. We've got Liverpool, Dortmund, Lazio and Olympiacos. 
Man City, PSG, Benfica, Basel. See, that's a much tougher group than ours. Easier, tougher. Uh, Milan, um, Valencia, Ajax, Shakhtar. That's a toughish group. Um, Real Madrid, Juventus, Spartak, and Fenerbahce. Barca, Bayern, Anderlecht, and CSK in Moscow. I think we've got the easiest group here. Man United, um, we've got Leon, Leipzig, and Dinamo Kiev. Um, Atleti, Napoli, Celtic, and RB Salzburg. So, yeah, um, we have got the easiest group by far. Carabao Cup, Bournemouth there, but like I say, we're not too bothered about that. But, yeah, we'll have Locomotive um, in our first group game. Um, we'll get that on the way. Um, ASAP. Right then, um, wonderful world of technology. I literally went to shut down OBS, which is the recording software, to finish off the episode. And the PC crashed. Literally just crashed right as I'm turning it off. Now I clicked it thinking, like, as, it, as I clicked it, it was exiting out of it. Thought I'd caught it. Obviously, I hadn't shut down spot on. And because of that, the files corrupted. So the game that we that you haven't seen because it's corrupted was against Locomotive Moscow um, we have won that game spoilers 3-0 and so because of that I'm now going to have to record another one um, because yeah, the reason I'm saying like we've got Liverpool coming up in the is is they are top and they've won five out of five games. Like you know what I mean? Um, I know we're not going really for the Premier League, but I just thought with it being Liverpool, I've been Liverpool so far. And we've we fought with Liverpool so much like last season. Should I just throw this game into today's episode instead of um, the Champions League game, which I've literally just played, or do I now play? Champions League game because but my question was do you guys want to see me do, and yeah <laughs> do you know what I mean so it's like it's kind of screwed up what I was going to do like I mean because I haven't got your feedback because obviously this is not live you know yeah I'm just gonna uh, I'm gonna play Liverpool uh, why not I mean I know it's not how it's supposed to be okay so this is weird because some of the players that didn't get to play in the Super Cup played in the Champions League and now you're not going to play in this one and I know that sounds weird because you're not going to see yourselves and I'm sorry but you're not fully fit as well so it's just <laughs> oh dear anyway this is the lineup <laughs> and there's the Liverpool lineup as well like sort of thing so and um, they've have sold um what should we call it? Um, Andy Robertson, you saw that. I, I think maybe maybe you didn't. Uh, I don't even know where the hell I'm up to, like, you know what I mean? But if you've not seen the transfers, Andy Robertson has been sold um, from Liverpool to Juventus, I think. Can't remember now he went to. But um, anyway, um, so I'll put Audrey Zola in at left back because they haven't got a left back at, at Liverpool. I mean, how stupid is that? Why does the game still do that? Um, I do not know selling players and they don't have anyone as backup. It's just stupid, isn't it? But. Um, anyway, um, let's crack on. I just need to get into this and my head's probably not going to be right anyway. Uh. <laughs> so, here we are at Anfield. How will Liverpool fare against Cambridge? Um, they beat us in the Community Shield again, I think, didn't they? Um, but we obviously we beat them in the FA Cup 4-0, I think we did last season. Okay, here is Mahoney. Honest now. Up to Mr. Misery, Mr. Charlie. <laughs> that's a great ball through. Oh, and that's a great strike as well. Wow. What a ball through. What a finish. Trevor. Going to celebrate in that corner with the Cambridge fans. Like I say, I'm not going to be putting you up by one overalls now there's no need you're, you're so high level um the players and stuff and i'm not too fussed about i uh, putting the the goal graphic thing up as well if in case you guys were wondering where that is gone it's it's not going to be there it just it, it, because i'm simming loads of the games to keep up with it and you're not going to see most of them like i say it, it's not it's not um a big deal that was a great challenge there from clark to win the ball here is charlie lawrence now gets this out here to jordan um decided to to keep him and no offense garber but obviously you played in the super cup and charlie yes and um uh, jordan didn't get to see his person if that makes sense you understand what i'm trying to say guys 
Right, Mahoney now gets this out here to hide it. Caused Liverpool no end of problems last time. Plays this back, Charlie. Little back heel tried to get through to Mahoney. We tried to catch him out there with some little skills there. Another corner. Drifted in. Good chance, Musley in off the post. He'll love to score that one. Everton fan. So he'll love scoring that goal. And he's captain as well. Like um, I don't know if I said that, but he is club captain now. Um, on Pepper, uh, I had a chat with him, and he's quite happy that that Mosley has become his captain. When Pepper's like 90 rated, so that's the reason why you don't say that to a player, do you? you know what I mean, you, you know, just because you're 90 rated now. <laughs> it's like, but no, he's just not going to get as much game time, to be honest. De Jong forward. Harry Wilson coming off the, the line there. Brewster. Back to party. Good ball through. Wilson. Oh, great strike. Well, he's gone all the way from being out here on the right-hand side all the way over to the left. And, um, yeah, that kind of um, gave them that extra body on that side. And what a strike that was. In off the bar. He's got in there and sneaked in. And, yeah, good strike. And back in this could have Rodolfo done better hmm Akinola Burn wins the header Arnes gets it back to Burn that's good play it's Burn it's a cross, it's Mahoney it's too simple gonna hug with, well sort of weird, weirdly through Burn there that was like weird um, and Arnes Side foot it in, casual as you like. Trevor's having a lovely time here at Anfield. Look at that, just calm as you like. Side foot it in. Waits for Hyder now to make this move. Cuts inside. It's Charlie. Lays it across. And no, oh, JJ doesn't really catch it that well. Oh, he didn't really catch it that well. But I think that because he didn't, it actually fools Allison. And we are absolutely destroying Liverpool right now. It just... <laughs> Alisson, I think, felt it was going to be more of a harder hit. Um, and he's gone down this way. And because he didn't catch it, well, he's actually gone the other side of him. And slid in and Alisson Becker there made to look like a, a fool. Like. Okay, I'm going to make um, a couple of changes. Charlie Lawrence is going to move out to the wing. Jordan Lawrence, who's just scored, is going to go off. So is Arnas. And on comes Wilde, who has got his um, green hair. So I just thought, see what um, you guys haven't seen him play. I have. Um, yeah. Um, and it was a weird game against Lokomotiv as well. It was a really weird game. Um, it's one of those where the players are only like 60 or 70 rated, yet they play like amazing, do you know what I mean? But we still won 3 0, but we got last. It was 1 0 for a long time. We got the last two goals um, late on. Having a battle with Marsden. Gets the ball in, and Sadio Mane only just come on. Wild, round the corner, Burn. What are you doing, mate? You'd have been better off just letting that run past your body. Musley pushing forward here from centre back. Wild gets this into Hyder. Little back heel inside. Mahoney, this time the hat trick. This time it is the hat trick. Wow. Hat trick at Anfield. Trevor will be pleased with that one. And there is Wild with his green hair. Mahoney is through, but he's actually played this out to Burn. It's Jason Burn. It's Mahoney again. It's number four. This is incredible stuff here. We are like 7 1 against Liverpool. This team, by the way, 5 and f for 5, you know what I mean, before this. Um, if we were to play, actually, the Premier League games this season. God knows how many goals we would actually score because we are literally ripping Liverpool apart here. Especially Mr Mahoney. He is literally having a field day. He's got four goals in this game just alone. 
Madness, absolute madness how good we are. We're looking to try and get some more here as Mahoney is trying to get that off Thomas party. Here's Xiao Felix. Wild has pushed him out. I think that's going to be the final action of the game. As Charlie throws it to Marsden and I'm sure Mr. Referee will blow and he does. Wow. The Anfield faithful will not be happy seeing that performance from their team. But this Liverpool fan here, Mr Mahoney, will be chuffed to bits. Four goals at Anfield. Mahoney doesn't get man of the match. I don't know what will be coming, but 12 and 8 on... I mean, we only got 8 on target, 7 of them winning in the back of the net. Oh, that's, and then again, um, Trevor hit the post in the end, one of them. But, it, yeah, it wasn't like we were, like, massively dominating. It was like, we just... We're clinical. That's what it came down to. I mean, if you look at those scores, normally we have more than that and we win 2-1 or something. It's, it's just, we were just clinical in front of goal. It, that's what it comes down to. Um, but we're not going to be doing much in the Premier League this season, guys. Um, but yeah, in some ways, I'm glad that I did play that game because you guys got to see um, some amazing stuff. But um, hopefully this saves this time. Um, thank you so much. There won't be any luck of the dice. I've, I've, I don't know if I've said that in previously but there's not going to be a look at the dice there's not going to be any upgrades for score it's literally this is just going to be a rush through season there might be an episode tomorrow there might not click the bell so that you don't miss out or just go to my twitter and um basically follow me and you'll see when the videos go up because i always post them on twitter anyway like sort of thing so yeah, one of those we massively appreciated. Um, sorry that you did miss the um, the Europa uh, Europa League. <laughs> there we go. It's just because it came up there then. The Champions League first game, but you will get two games um, in the next episode. I'll just say the next episode because I'm not sure when I'm going to put them up now. It's going to be Hoffenheim and Monaco in the next episode, guys. I definitely, and um, that's what it's going to be in there. It will be one this week, another one this week, if that makes sense. Whether it'll be tomorrow or it'll be Friday, one of the two. And um, there'll be another video go going up at some point as well, explaining what I'm going to be doing in FIFA 20 and PES 2020. So stay tuned for that one as well, um, um, because that I'll explain how things are going to be next season or next games, how you... I don't know how you'd say it. You know what I mean. Anyway, take it easy, guys. I'll catch you, and thank you so much for tuning in. But I'll catch you next time. Stay from me, Mongo Gaming. Signing off. Cheers.